possibly with the situation in the city at the moment, but everybody is not really knocking at doors. And then um, that's why we're, there's a little bit of delay, but I apologize on behalf of the committee. I deputized here two years ago, three years ago, and we had it in another area. We're very conscious of what Talker Festival is about. We're very conscious of what a person can do with a camera. Um, the last time I, I, I deputized, I made it clear to the committee that we were also conscious of Cork Corporation level, that the, the sponsorship of art we felt was going in the wrong area. In some places, we felt too much was going, and we felt in other areas, art for what it was worth wasn't being recognized. And I'm delighted to think that, at last, this year, Cork Corporation, in a small way, made a contribution and at last recognized that photography is an art. And I think we have to go back and we can look around here this evening and we look from the young to the elderly to the person that has a very keen interest and to the person that's taken not only an interest, that photography can be very interesting, can create a situation where people can create art, and they have done that. Looking around tonight, I see a cat inside in the booth. Now, if you weren't to take a photograph of that, or the person that did take a photograph of it, recognized it for whatever it's worth. And people enjoy that. To look at the photo, in respect of what it is, whether it be a place or a particularly a person, people always, always have a photograph in their pocket. I always have one a photograph of one particular person. And no matter where you go in the world, the person will take out of their wallet a photograph. And that's why we must recognize people for the work and the dedication that they put into it. And I'd like to congratulate everybody involved, and particularly our young people. I know this has grown from to strength to strength over the last few years. And I recognize the work in particularly that the committee put into it. But I want to thank, on behalf of my city, and in saying that, I must apologize that my law mayor is not here. But unfortunately, he had to be in other places. But I'm thrilled to be here. And to recognize what the people of Toker and the surrounding areas are doing for this area in getting people together to show their art. And I would hope that in years to come, that with the contributions and the grants that we can and hope that we'll be providing for people for this to grow, to get stronger and stronger, for people to take more interest in it, I know that if we put our dedication into it, we can do that. I know the VEC have taken an interest, and it's only right. And in doing that, we can bring it to other schools with our young people. I know that our people who are involved year after year, and I appreciate that too. But at the same time, I think it cannot go on without the voluntary work that goes on by the particular members of the committee. And they are the people that are the backbone of getting people moving in their own form of art. And I want to thank them again for that. The sponsors, and looking around at the prizes, year after year the sponsorship has been enormous. Each and every one of them has been very, very good to the committee and to the festival, and I want to thank them for that. On behalf of the people, on behalf of my law mayor, on behalf of myself, congratulations to everybody. To the person who's competing in particular, and to the person that's not going to win competing in next year, because that's what it's about, competing. Congratulations to everybody. I know that you're, and I'm thrilled to see so many young people around, to see the mothers with them, and to see them getting a little prize for what they think is creative. Again, it's my privilege and honor to be here and I'm thrilled to be among you, and I wish the competition more and more success. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen.